advised governments on the implementation and operation of investment-related residents and citizenship programs. What are the main factors that enhance a country's attractiveness and create favourable conditions for foreign direct investment? Well, these programs, there's a number of important factors. If you look at Cyprus in particular, as a synergy program, one of the things is, of course, the conditions here, um, including what you get as an investor, the quality of property, the quality of the passport, security of that. Um, these are probably the most important things, including also geographic location, relatively speaking, because there are people from all over the world that seek these um, possibilities in these programs, so opportunities through these programs. And therefore, it depends on also where you are located around the world. And, uh, certainly, Cyprus is a very strategic location for. You know, so it's interesting for many people. Oh, that sounds very promising. Thank you. As we mentioned earlier on in your interview, there's only one country ahead of Cyprus on the Global Citizenship Program Index in 2020. In fact, since the index was first introduced in 2015, Cyprus has always been rated second, which is nevertheless an excellent result for the island. But what would the Cyprus government have to do to climb into the number one rank? in accordance to the Henley and Partners ranking. That's an interesting question. It's already very good. I mean, how much you want to improve it's to be number one. I think important is probably this negotiation with the United States, the visa waiver that is about to come. So that includes then also visa access, free access to the US. That's of course an important answer. But frankly, also the way things are handled here in terms of the due diligence, the reasonableness of the intelligence as well. So it has to be very thorough, but it also has to make sense. And also it has to make sense for the government and also for applicants. And therefore that's another factor. It has to be very strict to so make sure you only get the right people. And we know that overwhelmingly you know, the right people here. It's a very small number of people that are nefarious characters that still come through the system mm -hmm. compared to other uh, for example, at the same time, uh, Cyprus had, say, last year 500 applications through citizenship investment, you had 5,000 people illegally immigrating to Cyprus. So that's a factor of 10 without any due diligence. So, you know, you have to put things in perspective. You know? And to improve things further, I think it would be useful to have maybe a central unit managing this rather than different ministries. And it's a bit unclear. So, you have a central operation where there's tight controls but also efficient processes so that the experience of the applicant is also good. People don't mind to bring a lot of information and due diligence to the government. If you have 53 questions, you can answer these 53 questions and bring the 35 documents or whatever is required. But it can't just constantly change. I think this is a downside a little bit, you know, right. that could be improved. But overall, Cyprus is excellent and an excellent position. So. Good, that's good to know. So you're saying the introduction of a central unit would help? Probably a bit of better centralized management of, of this uh, investment program that would also you know, help to, to explain better to other stakeholders like the European Union or others who are concerned, Policy. maybe. You know, policy in Europe or elsewhere would maybe concern who comes through these programs. But in fact, as I said before, there are only 500 people that are quite well documented and really thoroughly checked versus 5,000 that came into at the same time without any documentation or very little that are real security issues here. So that needs also better managed. So I think this, this uh, management of how this is put across uh, Policy communicated. Maker, communicate how this is done. This is maybe another point that could be improved. Yeah. Thank you very much. Pleasure.